While a lot of his critics argue that he did not deserve the 2023 Ballon d'Or, Lionel Messi was honored with a huge applause and a standing ovation from those in attendance when he was officially confirmed as the winner in Paris on Monday evening. It was a well-deserved award for unarguably the greatest football player in the history of the sport, a title he will possibly hold forever. For most of football figures, both active and retired, it was the befitting crowning of the Argentine magic man and to many who understand the sport, it had been obvious since he propelled his nation to their third World Cup title 11 months ago. But even after walking onto the step stage to pick his eighth golden ball presented by Inter-Miami president David Beckham, Messi was humble as always, remembering to thank those who supported him along the way, from his family to his teammates, his managers, and his mentor, the late Diego Maradona. This award comes hand in hand with what has been achieved with the Argentina team. This is a gift to the players, coaching staff, and all the people in Argentina. Howland deserved it very much too. This award could have been yours too. I'm sure in the next years you will win it, said Messi in his appreciation speech. As the Rob and Rig narrative rages on, what did the statistics say? The 36-year-old registered an average rating of 8 in 53 games while scoring 37 goals and assisting 25 times. Hallen, on the other hand, averaged a 7.4 rating per match across 56 games as he bagged 56 goals and made 9 assists.